Hey, what's up you guys? DJ Kevin over here from DJ Kevin TV One. As you guys can already see, this is my channel over here. Now I told you you guys about what is behind the scenes on the partnership program and uh, how it's different from normal part normal shit really. Okay guys, well this is my channel over here as you guys can already see. Very basic. We got the banner over here. Um, it's not clickable. But, and then you got, well, everybody has this. Um, there's my other channels and stuff like that. Well, let me show you what's behind the scenes of a partner program. All right, well, how do I get this banner? Well, you click channel setup. All right, well, here's a few things that, you know, look at all these buttons. They're so confusing. But when you get a hold of it, you'll know what you're going to do. So the avatar, everybody knows what an avatar is. I'm sorry that it's dark, but it's this thing over here. That's the avatar. The background is, well, the background. Now here's your channel banner, all right? Uh, the, the banner height, as you guys can already tell, they're gonna be upgraded to the YouTube one channel pretty soon. And then I'm gonna lose all this stuff. It's gonna suck, but that's how it's gonna be. All right, here's a channel ba banner area. And what this does is put that banner. See DJ Kevin TV one? That's a banner. All right, so it depends on how big your banner wants to be. So mine is 150 pixels, as you guys could already tell. Over here it says zero to 150 pixels. So, you know, this is 150. And then 140 will be over there where my cursor is, if you guys can see it. 130, 120, and then zero is no banner. The video watch page channel icon. I'm going to show you that in a minute, and I'm going to show you how to bring back the old video watch page. All right, so that's the channel banner and video watch page icon section. Over here is information and settings, your title of your channel. You know, this is all basic stuff right here. The, the channel information and sayings is mostly what everybody refers to for the cos for the Cosmic Panda when you're not a partner. But over here, when you're a partner, you get the advanced settings. So redirect URL means you could change, like I could change DJ Kevin TV one into DJ D, DJ Kevin Television. So I could change my URL. All right. So, uh, so uh, that's one thing that you could do for the YouTube partner, condition re redirector, redirectory. Uh, I forgot what that does though. I totally forgot. Tracked in image URL and Google Analyst account ID. Um, I don't use this personally right here where I'm going to highlight. I don't use that personally because it has Google, but I'm not a Google, I'm not a YouTube partner. I'm a, I'm awesomeness network partner, so I don't really use that. And the tabs are the same. You know, the tabs are the same. Um, the tags are the same. The tabs are the same, my bad. All right, so that is behind the channel settings of the, uh, the YouTube partner. But let's go to a video manager and show you what's behind the scenes of this part. Now, for an official YouTube partner, 2013 YouTube partner, you get over here, which is called a dollar sign, which is monetize. When you are a official partner with a, with a network, you get the claimed button, which is like a copyright logo. Which that means I'm getting money for all this, all these videos, 131 videos to be exact. So, um, so that's it. Oh, and the live event, uh, you could start up a new live event. You click here, and uh, from here you put down the title, description, the tags, when it starts. Excuse me. When it starts, when it ends, the country and time zone. That's the time zone over there, and then you press agree with the terms conditions for streaming on YouTube. All right. Oh, and then you could make it private or 
category and stuff like that. So, yeah. So that is that. Over here, this is shows. What you do, what you could do with shows is you could add. See, it's unreviewed. Administrator status unreviewed. I didn't review it yet, but you could create shows. All right, you could put in seasons. Like over here, I got um, two shows on here, episodes, and then I could just post that up on YouTube. Um, straight up from here. Uh, copyright notifications. Well, that's mostly your copyright. I only have two. Oopsie. Uh, search history, favorite, likes, and all of that. When you go to the dashboard, when you go to the dashboard, this is your dashboard. Everybody know what the dashboard looks like nowadays. So, YouTube partner? Not really. I'm a, uh, I'm an awesomeness YouTube partner. So this shows all your status and shit. Over here is channel settings. There you go. That tells you that I'm a part of Awesomeness TV Network. I'm in a network, so that shows you that. And analytics, you know, search up. Everything everything that you guys have, that being a non-partner, I have it too. But I got a little bit more stuff. Alright guys, so I'm going to show you how to get the old YouTube layout uh the old um let me go back to my dashboard the old youtube video watch page back all right very very simple very very straightforward you guys could check this out if you guys don't like the new video watch page uh for here let me show you what it looks like though all right let me show you what it looks like i'm gonna pause this all right guys so this is what the this is this is what it looks like it looks like an old it looks like the old YouTube uh, video page watch page right I got my banner over here I got my subscribe button I got the name of the video on top and I got the descriptions on the bottom views oopsie views and likes dislikes and flag um and everybody knows this is what you guys are mostly authorized to use all right. Hey, now, what's up, you guys? Shut up. Now I'm going to show you how to get it. All right. When you scroll all the way down, if you scroll all the way down into the, I think this is called the heading. No, the top is the heading. I think this is called the border down here. And then you see terms, pri privacy, policy, and save, send feedback, and try something new. You click on try something new, right? And then you got mood wall. HDMI 5 video, YouTube music discovery, feather, video questions editor, and topic explorer. You guys want the old video watch page back? Let me show you. You click feather, feather beta. This is me, this is uh, for low brand computers. See? With the low density possible. Limited features available to view and then uh, uh, technical. Blah, blah, blah. So all that good stuff. You get the br you get your banner on your video on your watch page and everything. All right. So this is not really beta anymore, but they still keep it there for low brand like low brand computers. Or if you want the old watch page back, you can get the old watch page back. Uh, you are not currently in the feather. They call that the feather watch page, the feather beta. But I want to use the Feather Beta. What do you do? Join the Feather Beta. You are currently in the Feather Beta. So if I go back to my video, you're in the old watch page all over again. You can make this permanent, you can make this permanent, or you could just use this, or you could go back to the old video watch page just this once. Or you could go back to the old video watch page, the, the new video watch page, I'm sorry, permanently. But you guys already know how to get it back. So, there you go. That's how you get the old video watch page back on your YouTube. Like I said, you get the branding options on the top here, and you get the subscribe button, your descriptions. And underneath here, underneath this big ass block area over here, will be your comments, like the old YouTube 
layout used to be. All right, guys, that's my video. That's how. That's the behind the scenes of the YouTube Partner Program, and that's how you get the old video watch page back. So I hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, see you guys next time.